I want you to do a short reflection on being not afraid. There's a lot of fear going on at the moment with the virus pandemic and panic in the shops and so forth. And But first of all, I'm not, not afraid because I'm burying my head in the sand or I think this is just um, fake news. I actually do think this is a real situation. I think something we have to be careful about and considerate and think about and listen to what's being said. But I'm not afraid for many reasons and I just chose four of them. The first thing is this, one, God is in control. He is sovereign, he is in control, no one can take that away from him. Um, secondly, he is my father and so he treats me like a son and he cares for me and he cares for those that I love. And uh, and the third thing is, is that he is faithful and he is faithful to, and his promises are true. He's faithful, uh, always has been faithful and he will continue to be faithful. I know that to be true. The fourth thing is, is it says perfect love casts out all fear and he loves me and he loves me perfectly. And so I know these four things. And I was just reminded of um, uh, Oliver Cromwell who once said, trust in God and keep your powder dry. He's talking about to his soldiers about the gunpowder of their guns. That um, Ultimately, let's trust God. Let's put our faith in God. But also we have an activity. We have a, something that we need to do. We need to be wise. We need to think about what we're doing with the things that we have. We need to think a bit about how we're living our lives. And so I think that's a really good balance because God says, you know, trust me, but also says, be wise, be wise as serpents, as gentle as doves. He talks about ask me if you need wisdom. And so there may be sorts of emotions and fear coming, but what we do know is that we can trust God that he is faithful, he is our father, he is powerful, he is in control, and he is sovereign all these things and he loves me perfectly so i do not need to fear and any kind of fear i can take up and i can bring it to god and ask god to speak and guide and bring give me wisdom so we need to be wise in these days and we need to be faith in faith not be afraid so i want to encourage you don't be afraid but keep trusting in the lord